Um, so, what, moms, dads, grandparents, everybody that's here, what, what we're going to do is we have um, some pictures of each of the graduates, um, I think four or five, and um, when, when they're ready, what I'll, I'm going to do is I'm going to read um, the graduate's name. I, I have a few little bullet points as far as some accomplishments or where they're going or what they did. Um, we'll go through that, and then um, we have a, a gift that we're going to present to them as well from the church. Um, first, we have Robert McMillan Ackerman. Yeah. Mills is an honors scholar. I think there's something special about you. He is um, going to attend Auburn University, War Eagle, um, and he'll be majoring in business. Um, why don't you come over here? Mills has been with us for about two years, three, two and a half years, thereabouts. Sorry. Um, he's a special, as they all are special. Um, the picture right there was a couple years ago when we had a chance to baptize him. And um, he comes most Sundays and almost every Wednesday night. And it's been awesome to see how he's grown, especially spiritually. He's had a tough year and a half. But um, he's persevered like a champ. And um, he gives God all glory for it, which is awesome. So Mills or Robert McMillan Ackerman. <laughs> so, love you. How you doing? We have, uh, so, we, so you know, we, this year we got our, our seniors um, study Bibles. And so each one of them will have a, a new Bible with their name on it. And, um, and I also have a, a, a pen that says, Be Strong with Joshua 1.9 on it. So, just a real reminder. So, why don't you come over here, stay up here. We're going to get them all in. All right, next we have Tanner Austin. Bess, Bessie, right? Awesome. <laughs> Tanner is graduating magnum cum laude, which sounds spectacular. <laughs> um, he will be a Attending the University of Florida. Don't know, no, no. <laughs> I know this is Seminole country, but we're, we're congratulating our seniors. Um, and he plans to um, go to medical school. So, um, big things. Tanner started coming to us through um, our Dine and Dash, primarily, right? And so on Thursdays during the school year, we would do a lunch for our child students. And this is how Tanner first started coming and hanging out with us. He's friends with the boys, too. And he comes pretty frequently on Sunday mornings, too. So, so we're, um, we're excited about, about Tanner, too. So, Tanner, we got you a Bible as well, man. Has your name on it. And we're just thankful for you and all that you do, man. Thank you. You bet you, buddy. Um, next, we have Miss Caroline Christine Kelly. <laughs> Caroline is an honor scholar as well. And she will be attending Troy University, majoring in nursing. Um, I have this frozen image of Caroline in my head as a curly-haired sophomore <laughs> at our D now. And she came and didn't really know. She knew Miss Bonnie and her kids, I guess. And that was about it. And she was there. And she had a smile like this on her face the whole time. And little did I know how the God would use her over the next few years. And um, as you heard that last song, God's gifted her with some amazing talents. And um, 
I'm just so thankful that you're here. <laughs> Good morning. We have a Bible for you too, Miss Caroline, with your name Thanks. as well. So you're welcome. Why don't you go over here? Sorry. I, I cut my finger, so <laughs> I got blood everywhere up here, but it's, it's a good thing there's a doctor in the house. <laughs> Just making sure I didn't drip on my cheat sheet here. Um, I'm good. I'm good. All right. Um, thank you. You never knew that preaching was this dangerous, did you guys? I'm telling you. Next is um, Re- Natalie Rebecca Laramore. Natalie is an honor scholar. Um, she is attending Troy University. Basically, all of our graduates, except for the boys, are going to Troy. And Emily's not either. I'm sorry. The three, the three, some are they're here. And she's um, going to be majoring in exercise science and plans to go to physical therapy school. I have known Natalie since she was like this. <laughs> She has the sweetest smile and one of the sweetest personalities that I know of. She's like a daughter. <laughs> Love you. Thank you. Man, this is the hardest part right here. We have a Bible. The good, the good thing about this is she's like a daughter, but I don't have to pay for a college. <laughs> so, love you. Um, next is Emily Ann Weatherall. <laughs> Emily is graduating cum laude. She is attending Florida State University in the honors program. That's awesome. And she plans to double major in biology and education. And I think Emily's track to us um, was somewhat similar to Tanner's in that you started coming through our Dine and Dash lunch that we do on Thursdays. And I think there's a certain fella here too that helps. (laughs) That's how we recruit kids. Um, But in our short time, she has been at church every Sunday, almost every Wednesday night. That big smile she has on her face is like constant. She's one of the sweetest, happiest people that I've had the privilege of knowing. And I just look forward to seeing how God's going to use you in awesome ways at Florida State. So thank you. Love you. We got a, a Bible here for you as well. So. That's awesome. All right. Next we have Brooke Lauren Woolery. How are you, Brooke? Brooke is attending Troy University. Are you guys all roommates too? Maybe. You think so? Absolutely. Oh, mercy. <laughs> crazy. Keep them in line. Um, Brooke is going to pursue pediatric nursing and or become a physician's assistant. Brooke is special for so many reasons. But there are little kids back there that absolutely adore Brooke. And one of the, the, the reason is when she sees them, she runs to them, she picks them up, she hugs on them and loves on them and invests in those little kids. Next school year, we're going to have a bunch of broken hearted little kids because <laughs> Brooke won't be here to pick them up and to love on them. But God has some amazing things in store for Brooke and we love you and we will 
miss you, but know you're coming back. So yes. <laughs> there's a Bible for you. I think before, if the slide thing's right, I think before we actually get to our, our last person, we have two that couldn't be with us today um, that are pretty connected to our church. Um, that's um, Sarah Lane and Justin Mishler. And they just recently graduated from Troy University. We may as well just call that a Redemption Hill satellite. Um, <laughs> um, but they just, they just recently graduated and um, they're moving back to Tallahassee. Sarah's doing some stuff at FSU and they're getting married. So um, that's exciting. They couldn't be here this morning. But then our last one is Miss, Mrs. Sarah M. Collins. She, um, she graduated from Florida State University with a Master's of Science in Integrated Marketing and Communications Management. Wow. <laughs> it sounds hard. <laughs> sounds like a lot. Um, you guys, this... When I moved to Tallahassee, Sarah and Tanner were juniors in high school, and I taught them in history. And here, she sends an email to me, and she's like, are you sure you want the old pregnant lady involved in this? <laughs> and in my mind, I'm like, well, if she's old, then what does that make me? <laughs> I'm just, uh, it, it excites me to see this family and how not only was she able to accomplish the goal of, of graduating, but she did it with two kids and being pregnant and Tanner for a husband. <laughs> That's right. Um, but we are so proud of her and um, there you are. Thank you. Love you. Love you. Excited for you. Awesome. Um, Let's, let's give them all kind of a big round of applause again, all collectively.